but there's no room to being broke <laughs> i do not know what i okay i have no i no okay don't get don't get offended if Okay, I haven't made a lot of money ever. Like, I don't know. I've not been able to make enough money, but I feel like I can give you a few clues on how you can make money as a young person, as a grown-up, and also you can make money as part-time. You can still make money when you're at home. You can make money when you're working. And yeah, so I'm just coming up with different ideas of how you can make money at your comfort zone. So first of all is something simple that i like saying you can make money using businesses online for example when i started as um uh, when i started doing business i started doing business online like i had the items with me like i went and bought items at wholesale or i got somebody who could bring them at my place at, at a wholesale price and then i take good pictures of the items and then I like post them on WhatsApp, I post them through Gigi, I post them on Facebook, I f post them on Instagram. And then like I could get clients and then I could call somebody who could deliver them for me. Or probably if I wasn't busy, I could deliver them by myself. So that's one of best ways of earning money without like actually too much work probably and also you can add, you can also do that kind of a business when you still have your own businesses running or probably if you're employed you can still work as you being as uh, as in you can still work when you've be, been employed and also come up with such businesses that are running and still earn money example if you want to sell accessories you can get somebody who's selling accessories at a wholesale price for example like let's say earrings things like this anything that you actually want to sell at a at a retail price somebody else might, might be selling it at a wholesale price so you uh, uh communicate to them tell them you want this amount of this uh, number of pieces and then if they can give you at a wholesale price if they agree to that you just carry your items home take very nice pictures and then you can deliver so another way of also not getting so much worked out when doing the deliveries is being able to rent a shelf for example at my store we are renting shelves at probably 1500 per month so in case you are working and you are doing businesses especially the online business you're able to like still reach your clients be able to provide for them and also you're able to ensure that you have enough stock for yourself this is how it works you go to the person who is the wholesaler selling the items you get the enough so you go to the wholesaler you get the enough items that you want to work with for example if you're working with accessories let's say earrings so you go pick the earrings from the wholesaler take them to the shelves where you've rented after doing that your work is to do the marketing probably or informing clients where they can get the items you know so you're not actually being you're not even working, you're not even doing anything. The only thing is probably picking up calls. Another thing is also you need probably to direct your clients. You also need to do a bit of more of marketing and also just tell your clients where they can get the items at. So there's nothing much you're doing. You can still have your businesses, other businesses going on, or rather you can still be employed and still working. Yeah. And remember, we also renting shelves at our store at a very affordable price, from one thousand shillings to three thousand shillings, depending on the size of the shelves. You're going to get a very nice. Way. And the best part is, we are doing marketing for you. We can also we're doing marketing, very nice delivery. We have very nice customer service. You cannot you cannot even bargain about that. <laughs> So the second one is you can do forex that's trading i haven't been to trading i haven't been like doing trading ever 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 but i feel like trading works for most people i used to have this friend of mine he was doing trading and i think suji kamal you are someone he's still going on but trading really 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 works um i don't want to say this on too much because I, I do not do gambling i don't do uh betting or anything but the people who make money through betting you really have to be a smart one that's what i usually say in everything you really need to be a smart one so 
betting can really work for you if you're doing it right i do not know what to say about it because i'm no fan of football <laughs> i'm no fan of football but i can say betting really works for people just that if you get the cash just do it the right way just jipanga the way you have to ujipange <laughs> uh -huh. another thing that is really giving money to especially young people and people okay just everyone out here is farming clues disclaimer i have this friend of mine who was rearing chicken and he was also i think he's rearing chicken and 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 plants potato with potatoes uh, potatoes yeah so he came to town recently and he was like telling me he's going to one of the hotels in town to check if he can get tenders from those hotels trust me you if that guy gets those tenders he's really going to be good he's really going to have the cash because you know your work is ensuring that the items get out of the chamber very perfectly packaging them well and delivering them to your clients and the moment your clients appreciate what you've done huh you're done nyambie if you have like probably three hotels working with you probably in a month you're, you're, you're delivering more than probably three times that's really a, a good deal and if it works for you i don't know what to say you're really going to have money so i think i think the only thing the easiest the easiest way on this thing is just knowing what works for you well yeah just know what works for you like don't do, don't do something because somebody else is actually doing it but just know what's working for you yeah so here he points it to those people who are more, more, more. <laughs> so this point goes to those people who actually have a lot of uh let's say mm -hmm, music systems you have a lot of probably those big hoofers and everything do you know you can be renting your, your sorry i'm used to renting shelves you can be renting your items to people at a very nice price and you earn the, and you earn from that and also so your work is just to maintain that that um that item for example if you have a music system you see and people have events they can rent the items from you at a very nice price and then you can earn from that it's like a business you can be having um you can ha be having those events probably at the end of the week probably is a weekends is my weekends up then you can be renting those items to different people kuna wase wabash kuna watu wa uh, baby showers we have uh, engagements and all that you rent them to those people and then they're going to pay you and you're going to have money i feel like it's just that you can't do everything you think all the time uh, another thing is nowadays jimmy have this thing where you advertise their item after advertising the item if that client buys item from them you get a commission i don't know it's called it's called jumia jumia force or jumia something so your work is to your work is just to advertise the item using a link so after advertising the item to people they get your they get to that um they get to that product they purchase using that link then you end up getting a commission another thing is you as probably let let's say me as rose i i, I just want to to promote jumia so i get the link i can be buying items for my clients like i'm selling them just online i'm just on my free days i'm just there there checking on items and you can be getting the, you can be getting the items for you can be getting items for your clients at a very cheap price meaning that you're getting a commission out of it so let's say if a product goes for a hundred bob probably you're going to get uh let's say 30 bob or 15 bob or pro, i don't know how much it is but it's i'm sure if it piles up at the end of the month probably you're going to get a good deal that is what i feel yeah i don't know i don't know if other shopping uh shopping needs work like that but for jumia it's it's really works it's called jumia for so you, you can be buying items for your clients and then like you just get a commission out of it at how you money you take an item from jumia and you are you are um you're there i don't know they're called jumia force 
committee or something. I don't know how they say, but ambassador or something like that. Let me say you're the word ambassador. Probably you're an ambassador of, of, of Jumia. Probably you're getting commission out of it. Even when you want to buy your own items, you're also going to get the commission from, from them. So it's also a very nice way of earning. I don't know what you guys are thinking outside there, but whatever idea you have about... Um, making money online making money just for especially for our young people i'm from school i do not know how everyone outside there is surviving when it comes to to to, to getting jobs and everything i haven't been thinking about being employed or anything like that but i feel like you can still make money with employment or without employment that's what i say when you're employed you can still make money candle if you're not employed you can make business as your own as your major major way of earning money and at the end of it all you still make up to your deal your bills that's what i say at the end of the day let's clear our bills <laughs> okay it's been an amazing time with you guys i have enjoyed it i know those tips probably may work for you or may not work for you but at least find some way of earning extra money probably or uh we say side aside cash have a side way of earning cash and a side job probably or anything to just make yourself sustainable because it's almost halfway the year. We don't know how things are going to work for the coming year. We do not know, but let's make money. Let's make money. Let's, guys, let's win. I just tell my friend, like, let's win. Like, just do as much as you can to ensure that you have, you have you have if we are able as in you're just able to clear your bills another secret of life that i've always learned is live below your standards buddha just live okay i don't know just live below your standards i even if you're earning okay even if you're earning 30k rich now just live below your standards it saves you a lot in the coming future and it also saves you a lot you do not get stressed and we have to live, deal with anxieties and depressions and me, 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 me. No, just live below your, 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 your addicts. Just from the corona pandemic thing, man, I've just learned to always have something somewhere. You make a tweaking goja in case kukwe kuzuri kukwe kubaya. I've just learned to always do that. Like have a saving, have a, a saving plan. Ensure you have ways of of having extra cash without without the struggles especially when you're employed um and if you're earning ensure you just save before you save before you spend that I, yeah save fast before you spend have a saving plan and ensure you live below your standards it will save you a lot i know you're going to thank me later okay it's been an amazing time guys i'm super excited um, I know it's a very short video, but I know you've learned a lot and I've also learned a lot. I like end up reminding myself so many things that I think I know, but I have also learned amazing stuff. See you guys in the next video. Hope you've, you've had fun. And in case you have a business idea or just a simple way of earning money, share down there on the comment section. So there's this thing that I've always had people say at him. You ask somebody, um, how do you how do you earn money? Or hey, manze ume umeomoka rada ni gani? Then somebody is like, manze ni God. If you can hold somebody's hand, just hold it, man. Don't 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 put God in place. Okay, yeah, it's really nice that God has been there for you. But wacha kus wacha mungu ama 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 sijui. If actually somebody has put you in that place, help somebody else so that they can you guys can umoka pamoja. I know, just. Help somebody. And that's why I say if you have an online business, I don't want to leave you behind. Rent a shelf at a very affordable price to ensure that you are always at par. Bye-bye, guys, and see you in the next video. I love you.